I'm going to be performing the Lockman's test. I'm going to have my patient laying supine on the table, and I'm going to be on the side of the affected limb. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab their leg, put them into a little bit of flexion, and what I do is I have them kind of roll over into my hands and just make sure they're relaxed. They want to make sure they're relaxed because the test won't be, I don't get a good test if they are muscle guarding. And so what you want to do is this proximal up top hand here is going to be on the proximal side of the knee joint, as close as you can get. And then my lower hand is going to be over the tibia, and I'm going to grab around the side, almost on the back here. So this proximal hand is going to be stabilizing. The distal hand is going to be doing the movement, make, translating that to be anteriorly on the femur. So I'm going to stabilize here, and then I'm going to flex them a little bit, make sure they relax, and get that translation there, feeling if there is any laxity in that ACL. If I get a positive test, if I don't get an end feel while I'm doing the Lockman's, and that would be positive for an ACL tear.